greetings to Nova Digital TV viewers. Once there was a young boy who came to practice football every day. And he came along with his father. And his father used to sit at the far of the ground. He practiced every day along with the coaches and then other players. But he could not make it to the final team. And then he was absent for the quarterfinal and the semi-final. But he came on the final match and pleaded the coach that he wanted to be part of the final team. The coach said, no, there are better players than you. I don't want to keep our school at stake. For me, the reputation of the school is very important. The boy kept on pleading. The coach had never seen this boy pleading like this before. Finally, he said, you can play, but don't let me down. For me, the important is the reputation of the school. Don't keep our school at stake. He went to the ground. Every ball that he got it, he shot a goal. Needless to say that he was the star of the game and his team had a spectacular win. At the end of the match, the coach approached him and asked, how come I have been wrong for so many days? And what has happened to you that today you played very well? The boy replied that today my father is watching my game. Then the coach went around and saw his father, but his father was not there. So asked him, where is your father that you said that he is watching your game today? Then the boy replied to the coach, that I have not told you that my father was blind just four days before he died. But I am sure today, the first day is watching my game. My dear young boys and girls, inner motivation comes from within. It is an inner gratification. It is an, a feeling of accomplishment. It is an everlasting because it comes from within. What we need to do, we need to identify and constantly motivate them. For that, you need to write it down your goals and read in the morning and the evening. In order to get strengthened, we need to have people like the father for this boy in the story. It was his father who strengthened his self-motivation. And then he translated that inner motivation into self-motivation and he succeeded it. That is what we need to have today. We need to identify our inner motivations, our goals, and then try to translate them. In order to get strengthened, we need people like our parents. We need people like our friends, our own coaches, our own teachers. Once it gets strengthened, I'm sure you will be able to translate into action. I'm sure you will succeed it. 
it is a great opportunity for all of us to identify our motivation in this period of pandemic and get strengthened with the help of our own people and translate them into action i'm sure you will succeed it thank you